Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas one state under God, one indivisible. Now for a moment of silence. It's Monday Friday. What's, What's for lunch, lunch today? today? Today for lunch. Lunch is hamburger. 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 Or. or Cheese sticks. Cheese sticks. My name for breakfast is breakfast rice or cereal. Cinco de Mayo in English means the 5th of May. That's the day in 1862 when the Mexican army won a surprising victory over the French at the Battle of Puebla. They were outnumbered nearly two to one. Many people think Cinco de Mayo celebrates Mexican independence, but that's not actually true. Mexico had been independent from Spain since 1810, but was unable to pay its debts to Europe. France saw an opportunity to move in and claim territory. 6,000 French troops set out to attack Puebla, a small town in eastern Mexico but an underdog force of about 2,000 loyal Mexicans defeated them. Their heroism was a source of great pride for the people of Mexico. Today, Cinco de Mayo is celebrated more in the U.S. than it is in Mexico, especially in areas with large Mexican-American populations, like Los Angeles and Chicago. It is celebrated with Mexican food, mariachi music, dancing, and other special customs. Cinco de Mayo honors the strength and courage of the Mexican people at the Battle of Puebla, and a victory that seemed impossible. Have you ever overcome an obstacle that made you want to celebrate? For lesson plans, digital resources, and more teacher support materials, visit pbskidslearningmedia.org. It's a great day to be a dragon. And all the dragons say... Yeah!